There is only one spot remaining to represent this region, and it goes to Thailand. How are you? I'm great, thank you. Well, here's your question. I hear that while preparing for Miss Universe, you were taught to do something called a duck walk. Uh, what is it, and does it involve any quacking? <laughs> no, it doesn't involve any quacking, but what it is is as an athlete, I needed to learn how to do more hip swing so that I can improve my catwalk. And so what it is is you are on high heels, I'm gonna kind of mini demonstrate here. And then you go down and you pop your hips one way and the other. So on the, so the reason why it's called a duck walk is because if you walk like that, it kind of resembles looking at a duck like wagging its tail, its butt. So, but no, you don't need to, to quack when you walk. In, in America, that has nothing to do with a duck at all. <laughs> nothing. Thank you, Thailand. <laughs> Top 20 semi-finalists. Let's meet them all one more time. Thailand. I'm just an ordinary person who believes that ordinary people can do extraordinary things when they believe in themselves have courage to take that first step and to never give up in the face of adversity. I'm standing here today because I followed my heart and dared to live my dreams. Thank you. Two spots left in the finals. One goes to Thailand. As a kid, I had a little nickname. Um, I was a little doctor because I loved helping other people. After I won Miss Universe Thailand, that's when I realized that, hey, there's actually a different path, a different way that I can help other people. I am able to help flood victims or to the We Are One, my art project. It gave me an opportunity to help people on a larger scale. Just seeing them happy, just seeing them like give me back a smile, that for me is my reward. Thailand. Let's hear it for our top 10 finalists. These women are quite literally the best of the best, and they are ready to compete as hard as they can to win the title of Miss Universe 2019. That is when I feel the most powerful, when I'm in my element. Thailand! I feel powerful when I know that my journey is able to help inspire and motivate as well as encourage other people to take care of their body and to feel happy being healthy. Mexico! How about that top 10? Clap your hands for everybody. to spend some time with the reigning Miss Universe. Don't miss it. We'll be right back. Thailand. My dress portrays how I am playful, but at the same time, it has one of my favorite colors, which is red, and I really love red because it signifies the color of love.
When we come back, five will move one step closer to being crowned Miss Universe 2019 live on Fox. Also, still in the competition, Thailand. Thailand, you're next. Here's your question. Government surveillance is used to keep many nations and their people safe, but some believe this invades our right to privacy. What is more important to you, privacy or security? Ooh, that's a very tough question. I believe that every country has their own uh, government policy to keep us safe, and I believe that it shouldn't cross the line of going into our privacy because we have a right to privacy but security is also very important so I believe that in order to live in a better society we should also have the government look into a line a middle ground as to where they can come and live together with society That's good. thank you Thailand Colombia come on over <laughs> <laughs> 